Question number 27, uh, vectors. Part A, write down in terms of A and B an expression for uh, the vector SQ. Uh, to go from here to here, using the known vectors A and B, we have to go backwards down this vector and then along this vector here. And when we go the opposite direction down a vector, we change the sign. So minus B plus A. Part B, express NR in terms of A and B. So we're looking for this vector here, in terms of the vectors we know, A and B. Okay, using the vectors we know, um, this one here and this one here, if we add those two together, just like we did for part A, we can get the vector NR. Um, this one is easy because this is a parallelogram, opposite sides are equal, so therefore this vector is A. This one is a little bit more complicated uh, from N to S, but we, we can do it. Uh, we know S to Q is minus B plus A, and because we're told the ratio of these points, we can work out um, this vector here. Now, this is three parts, this is two parts, so the whole thing is five parts, and this is three-fifths from S to N is three-fifths of the length from S to Q. And we know a vector for from S to Q, so we can use this to work out the vector from S to N. <laughs> Multiply through and you get that SN is minus three-fifths B plus three-fifths A. But to get um, the vector from N to R we need to go backwards down this vector here so we need to change the sign And now to get NR, we need to add that vector to this vector here. So we've got 3 fifths B minus 3 fifths A plus A is 3 fifths B plus 2 fifths A.